Hey, it's Randy from UC Status. This one is a really quick one to follow up my last video on the Logitech Rally Bar. Um, it's just to say that the Rally Bar, the Rally Bar Mini, its little brother, are now certified for Microsoft Teams in appliance mode. The other exciting news is the tap console that you normally get in another USB or Cat 5e variant is now also certified uh, to work with the Rally Bar and the Rally Bar Mini in appliance mode for Microsoft Teams. It means that you connect the device directly to the back of the Rally Bar or Rally Bar Mini and it turns it into a full Microsoft Teams room. The user interface is exactly the same as you'd get on other devices from the likes of Yealink with their A20 and A30 and also a Polycom with their X30 and X50 range. Um, the difference is, is instead of pairing with it over Ethernet, it actually connects directly to the device. So you can see you've got the Meet Now here. You've also got a sharing button, which I'll, I'll go to through in a minute. And of course you've got more. You've got the clock as you normally would. If you send an invite to the room, it will appear on the left. Now I've gone ahead and sent an invite to the room and you, as you can see you've got the calendar rail on the left as you normally would. You've got a join button, the Teams logo as you would normally see it appear. And of course on the screen as well you've got it in this uh, calendar box at, as well. So joining meetings is just a tap of a button. You just tap the join screen and you're in as you can see. And you'll be able to see what the camera can see which is not a lot. Of course, you've got the normal kind of controls on the screen here. You've got the participant window. You've got the sharing button. You've got some more stuff like lock the meeting, etc. You can also exit the meeting with just a single tap. The other great thing that the tap console gives you, as you, you've noticed, no doubt, is the buttons from here disappear, which means you don't need to use the remote control and you know what I thought about the remote control in my long review best left unsaid um, and it also means you don't need to use a mouse and keyboard or a trackpad or anything like that this becomes the whole remote control experience so if you go into more and then you've got you know feedback meet now and of course your sharing button your volume and, and mute here but also then you can go into settings and either meeting settings which allows you to turn on things like show participant view, proximity join, and allow remote control. But also then you can get into the device settings, which I've showed you before, and it allows you to get into the actual settings. Normally, if you were just using the remote control without the tap console, this kind of stuff would appear here, and you'd have to scroll around using the remote controller, or as I said, mouse and keyboard, and you can get out all of your other settings. Now, if I go back to Teams, and just go back to the main home screen. It's just exactly the way it was. And that's it. That's all I wanted to share today is that the Rally Bar and the Rally Bar Mini from Logitech are both completely certified by Microsoft for Microsoft Teams rooms in the kind of small to medium uh, category. And also that the Tap Console makes it an absolutely usable device. Don't need to use a remote control anymore. And I'll catch you in the next video.